I ain't talking to Amory Zach Kima, and Zach's got a few more months in the state there. He's headed to England to play play soccer. Zach, we've talked about it, man. Just kind of talk about how you decided to go to, to England and play soccer and what you're looking forward to. Maybe something maybe a little nervous about. Uh, yeah, definitely, definitely a little nervous. Uh, definitely got the nerves churning a little bit inside of me. Uh, you know, it was I made my decision based off the uh, best place I could get my major in, which is going to be sports administration and sports medicine. And they also offer a coaching license. So and within the first two years, I'll have my coaching license. And, uh, you know, it was between Florida Southern, um, Lindenwood, which is in St. Louis, or St. Charles, and uh, Richmond University, of course, or, uh, Riza, I can't I don't think I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it's a uh, Richmond University. Um, you know, it uh, it's a big time decision, of course. I mean, I'm going overseas six to eight hours away. Um, ba basically, it was just uh, I went over there before Christmas, and um, you know, I got to play in a uh, game with them. Uh, unfortunately, we lost two to zero, but you know. Uh, uh, I hit the post once, had a couple good crosses. Uh, I got to play with most of the players. Uh, they liked me, I liked them, I liked the coach. Uh, coach told me I was a heck of a player. Um, he said he'd love to have me. And I kind of knew then that <clears throat> I was kind of iffy about it at first. And then, uh, you know, as time came through and they said, hey, you know, uh, everything's paid for, you don't have to worry about any uh, money wise. And I was like, man, I'm not, uh, I'm not really gonna get that anywhere else. Uh, when I talked to the coach from Lindenwood, uh, he sent me, right before I even called him, he sent me an email and said, uh, congratulations, I look forward to watching you play. And uh, he said that, uh, he said it's just, it's different things that kept him. He said if it was up to him, he would have offered me a scholarship the night that he came and watched me play. But, you know, uh, it, some things happen. In, in my opinion, I believe, uh, it's a quote, everything happens for a reason, and I think uh, in the long run, this will actually help me out. Now, you're open about wanting a chance to play pro soccer down the road. Is it, would that play into the fact decision as well? Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, I, my dream, is, uh, ever since I was about a yeah, yeah, little kid, uh, I've always, I looked, I looked up to the people that I watched on TV. I was like, man, I hope I can do that one day. And, uh, you know, it, it, again, that comes to... We've had interviews before where people in high school said, "Oh, you can't, y'all can't go to state, or you can't score this many goals, or something like that." You know, I just, it it just motivates me even more to try and you know, try harder, just to try and prove them wrong. And one day when it happens, they're gonna be like, "Oh, well, he made it. I didn't believe he could, but he did." Uh, you know, uh, going to England, it's like the capital of soccer. So, I mean, and I've got a, a pretty good chance at making it pro if I keep my head straight, don't, of course, not get in any trouble and uh, do what I got to do. All right, Zach, congratulations, man, and good luck. Thank